The most important thing to me is my education and my family. Without those two things, I couldn't see myself going anywhere. My name is Rogelio Perez Garcia. I am a senior at David Douglas High School in Portland, Oregon. One of the things we focus on in general with freshmen is are they the first in their family that could graduate high school because we know that there's extra barriers, obstacles that come in the way if you are the first. I mean, my mom only finished uh, fifth grade. My dad only went up to his sophomore year. My mom was 14, my dad was about 18. They got married and uh, they had me. When I was about 10 years old, my mom had my younger sister. Before my sister was born, my dad left. Me and my mom raised her. I had to take care of her. When my mom had to go to work, uh, I had to bathe her and change her diapers, feed her. Even though she was always working overtime, she was making minimum wage. We've always been in poverty. When she would have to work till midnight, I would just uh, just wait for her to come home sometimes. It was kind of hard. I'm just kind of shocked that I didn't know that about him, you know? It amazes me that he's done what he's done while taking care of that child because I know how overwhelming that can be in and of itself. My parents had a really big influence on my education and me uh, going to college and finishing high school. And they always used themselves as an example and how they had to work so hard for simple things. I want to have a career and I want to help my family out of poverty. For Rogelio to break that cycle, I mean, he's just changed his whole family development, his whole family pathway, and it's huge. <laughs> my GPA is about a 3.56 right now, and I've worked really hard for it these past three years. He's not only stayed in school, but he's become so involved with our um, community service program. I've spent most of my um, volunteering hours at CHAP, the Children's Healing Art Project. Um, they're a nonprofit that takes art programs to the hospitals for children going through severe illnesses and treatments like cancer. Art can help heal people, and that gives them, it gives the children a way to forget about their illness and about the treatment. It's exciting to think that Rogelio has just changed what his siblings think is possible in life, what, what they think and know they can do now, and not just his siblings, but the community beyond his family. This year, um, me and another student from David Douglas are starting Mecha, which is a student organization that tries to help the Latino community pursue higher education. Rogelio is amazing from, for what he's done. Um, having no example set before him of how to get through school and figuring it out and not only getting through school, but excelling in school. Without education, it's really hard to have a say in things that go on in the community or your school. Education is power.